What's up, everybody? It's your boy, Krim Rider, Krim Rider Kicks, coming to you live from the shoe locker, coming to you from Jackson, Mississippi. And what I got for you today, man, is a review on a shoe that I thought was dope. As we all know, Jordan came out with the whole city pack. I think the whole city pack idea was dope. It's not the first time that they did it because they did the city pack before in the uh, tens. But they were just mainly uh, American cities. And now I like the fact that they branched out. They had the Paris, the Londons. The, they did Chicago, New York, Charlotte, L.A. That's all I've seen so far. There might be some more. But uh, those are the ones that I know about. And um, the idea of the city pay was pretty dope. Most of the shoes, I will, I have to be honest and say that I didn't really, wasn't feeling the colorway, wasn't feeling, you know, the way they put the colors together, especially that Chicago, like the way they did the red with the baby blue. But, you know, hey, it is what it is. But it was one that really did catch my eye, and it was one that I wanted and one that I had to have. I also thought that this was the best looking one in the city pack, so I had to get it. Um, the Rios were nice too, but I passed on them, but they did sell out. But most of the city pack is sitting and they're still sitting in stores. So maybe if, you know, a few go to outlet, I may pick up a few, but as for buying them retail, it was the only one that caught my eye. And with no further ado, I will show it to you. And that was none other than the Jordan Retro 10 LA out of the city pack. I felt as if this was the best one in the city pack. Giving you a close up on it. Giving you a look at the back. You can see the inside, maybe too dark. And of course the bottom. But well, let's just sit this right here, get in on it, and let's talk about this city pack, man. Like I said, this was the best one out of the city pack, in my opinion. Um, the LA, because it went with the 10 silhouette, went with the blue and the white at the bottom, the all white wrapped around the bottom. I thought that was really, really dope. It had like the turquoise like blue at the top that just set it off right in the LA and turquoise set it off right. Um, but I think the white wrapped around the bottom, man, was just so sweet. And if you just take a quick look, look at the shoe, I like, I really was feeling like the look of denim. It has like a denim look, an ashy like look. But this shoe has really great detail. That's why I'm really just like surprised that it was sitting like that because it has really, really, really great detail. As any other 10, all the accomplishments on the bottom. I love the pull tab at the back. But like I say, this material this denim look, and it also has the look of denim wrapped around the top, as you can see. Rope laces like every other 10. Speed laces. But man, like I say, it was it was really, in my opinion, it was the best one out of the city pack. It's just me. A lot of people might like, you know, a different one. But in my opinion, it was the best one in the city pack. That's why that was the one that I got. Um, now the London, the London, it looks nice. I like the gold on it, but I don't know if it's going to drop over here. If it does, I may try to pick that one up. But like I say, this one was the only one that I like. And actually, I really still was going to pass on this one right here. But I got a great deal on it. A guy 
on eBay. He said he wore it once and was just trying to get rid of it. And um, ended up let me get it for way, way below retail, like 125 So I had to jump on it. So, yeah, man, I was happy to have it. So there it is. Chicago Retro 10 City Pack LA. Great look. Great denim look. Can't wait to rock it. It's going to be a great summer shoe for me. And that's about it, man. To the next review, it's your boy Crim Rider. Crim Rider Kicks. Jackson, Mississippi. Like I always say, don't hurt nobody and don't let nobody hurt you. Peace.